Hello YouTube, this is Captain Bart One. Uh, been a long time since I've made a video, and what better way to start than a new uh, EDC pocket carry video? So I thought I'd uh, go over that with you, and uh, there'll be a, a new bag video here uh, this go around, and hoping to shoot some footage just all the way around. Uh, we'll start out with uh, all the the regular suspects there, a uh, bandana. The key ring here that's not changed at all, you know, Weatherman Micra, uh, Boy Scout Hot Spark, P51 Tick Tweezers Handcuff Key REI Whistle, uh, Pill Fob with uh, Baby Aspirin, and uh, Fire Starter. Uh, my uh, challenge coin that I carry this time, it's a, uh, it's actually from, uh, I don't know how well we can get that. From the uh, Rush World Tour here, uh, 2012 and 13, for the Clockwork Angels Tour, the wife and I uh, got a real uh, neat little package deal. You get a uh, oh, a program and a coin, and that that's what that's from. I just carry that right now instead of the Chinook Air Force Base anniversary coin. Uh, lump of paracord here, about 10 foot. <clears throat> uh, new lighter option. This is a Zippo. I've had the Zippo, but I finally broke down and got one of the Thunderbird inserts, the uh, the uh, Butane. It's the not jet torch one, the one you get the regular yellow flame from. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, flashlight option has changed, and I'll explain why here in a minute. Right now, it's a Phoenix E11. And uh, I scanned the pocket clip off of LD22 and put that on. It works fair. It's not too bad. Uh, pocket knife has changed. Uh, as you guys remember, I was carrying a couple of different Titty Granddad knives, and uh, I liked them, but uh, found that uh, the liners and such were giving me fits with er pocketing, you know, pocketing every day and this and that and. So I got rid of them for a brief time. I carried a Spyderco Endura full flat grind uh, VG10 blade. Awesome little knife. Little. Um, awesome knife. And I happened to come across this rascal right here. This is a Benchmade small Summit Lake. Look at that. S30V lockback wood scales. I think it's Cocobolo. Cocobolo. Uh, it does have a pocket clip, but it's right-hand carry only. I took it off because I'm left-handed, one. Two, I just wanted to carry it in my pocket. And that rascal, just shy of three inches. It, it carries nice. It, it says 30V. I've got a lot of experience with that steel. Never had a bad day with it. Always, always, always good stuff. Uh, like I said, I stumbled into that and picked it up, and I retired the Spyderco, and actually I've since sold it. Uh, I like this knife that much. <clears throat> uh, the Fossil Money Clip, uh, Fossil Credit Card Wallet, uh, these both ride front pocket. And then on the multi-tools thing, I've changed what I do a little bit. Uh, this is the Super Tool 300. I just got a new case for it. And the old case, which is the hybrid nylon leather case, looks like... This rascal this is the one I use for my 200 that's in uh, my bob. Uh, it had a flashlight, well, this would hold the bit, ex uh, the, uh, bit driver, and I used that for a little pen light. Well, it rattled a lot. When I walk around the boat, you could hear it rattle against the case, and it was driving me insane, so I bought the nice all-leather case, and that's why I'm carrying the Phoenix E11 now in my right pocket. Anyway... Now this right here is a Leatherman Sidekick pocket clip carry. It's a good deal smaller than the 300, and it's it's not quite as able, but it really it is kind of. Um, it has a saw, it has a knife blade, it's got screwdrivers, it's got the cap lifter. Like I said, it's a good deal smaller. It's probably three and a half inch handles, something like that. Spring loaded pliers. And I've just been playing with it as a um, new possible change just because I get tired of having the bat belt on, if you know what I mean. Um, so I, I'm going to keep experiment, experimenting with this. I got it for, I got the uh, 
idea from Bush Bowman 29. He carries one, and I liked it enough where I said, you know, I want to check that out. So I swung through Bass Pro here locally, and I sniffed on one and said, I'm going to pull the trigger. So that's it. That's the pocket carry. This experiment here with the multi-tool back and forth between the 300 and the sidekick will be ongoing. We'll, we'll see... At one point, I stop and go, nope, nope, nope. I've got a, I've got a side with, whatever. So, uh, I appreciate the subscriptions. I'm coming close to 200 subscribers. That's amazing. When I started this two and a half years ago, it was mind-boggling. Uh, it's mind-boggling now that 200 people really care. And uh, at any rate, uh, if you aren't subscribing, please do. If there's anything you'd like to see or hear about. And I'm going to try and do some other things here this week while I'm home, etc., etc. i got some other projects cooking. I've reorganized the lair and some other things. If there's anything you'd like to see, send me something down there. And until I get to talk to all of you again, this is Captain Bart 1, standing by.